right beautiful people i'm back again today like i said this is a continuation of self-care for Jalen as a autistic higher functioning child he is somewhat overweight and so we've been talking a lot about reducing his weight and i'm trying to make healthy choices for him and we're trying to get some weight loss of doing re of reducing his weight so i'm gonna let him do the hula hoop even though he's a boy right now i don't have a treadmill so anything to help him get this weight off and down here at my other house we don't have a bike for him to go outside and ride so other than him just sitting here doing anything is okay for him to do the hula hoop i told him you don't have to be a girl I mean, um, yes, a girl to do the hula hoop. So as long as you're getting the benefits that you need, which is to help you reduce the weight. All right, Jalen, let me see. Can you do the hula hoop for three minutes? Okay. Okay, you're doing good. As you can see, mm -hmm. he's almost been doing it now for a minute. I just told him all he needs to do was three minutes. As long as he gets exercise in, it doesn't matter. You don't have to be a girl to use the hula hoop. The benefit is to get cardio. And to, so he can help reduce his weight. This is the more noisy one. As we can see, this, very noisy. this hula hoop here is very noisy. I'm going to get the other one. Probably order the other one that's much quieter. Because this one here is very noisy, as I say. But, well, Jalen is almost done. But anyway, guys, um, like I said, I just wanted Jalen to get some exercise in than to just be sitting in the to just be sitting in the house doing nothing. All right, guys, to the next one.